Hello everyone. This video is going to answer a WD spin stop question. The question is: the WD hard drive spins and it stops, and then spins and stops again, runs in this way for a few times, then totally stopped. What happened, and what is the solution going to be? The hard drive is a small computer. The PCB board is the motherboard. The drive is the peripheral of the PCB board. For computer, when power up a computer, the computer's motherboard will check and initialize everything linked to the motherboard. We call this period as post time. After all set. The motherboard will start Windows, Mac, or other user programs. For hard drive, when power up a hard drive, the first thing the PCB board to do is to load all the configuration data, like plist, glist, or others, from the disk to the RAM on the PCB board. This process is called hard drive initialization. Same as the computer's post-time initialization. So the WD spin stop problem is the hard drive's initialization is failed. It cannot communicate with any computer. That is why the computer cannot detect the hard drive. As long as the hard drive's PCB board can control the drive to spin and stop. Most likely, the PCB board is okay because the hard drive initialization is failed. For the most cases, the disk is the problem. The computer cannot detect the hard drive, so the most of the end user software cannot fix this kind of problem neither. This kind of disk failure problems need disk. Data recovery operation. This picture shows the procedure how we do data recovery for our clients. First, the client send their hard drive to us. Second, we do data recovery. Third, we ship back the data to our clients. Thank you so much for taking your precious time to watch my video. Any comments are really appreciated. If this video is a little bit of help, could you please click on like to support me? Thank you again. Bye.